Hi, this is Pastor Stephen with another thought for the day. So let's just start with a deep breath. So this is a good one for London. From Mark Nepo, to affirm our person. And it starts with a quotation that I found really interesting. Wisdom tells me I am nothing. Love tells me I am everything. And between these two, my life flows. Then the story, which is amazing. Having survived the inhumanity of the Holocaust and the death of her husband, Dr. Elks, the revered elder of the Kovno ghetto in Lithuania, told her son, years later, of the two objects that sustained her. One was the piece of bread which she always had about her person. The other was a broken piece of comb. She kept the bread in case someone needed it more than she. And no matter what morning and night, she would comb her hair to affirm her person. What Miriam Elks carried and how she used what she carried is a profound example of how the spirit can turn ordinary objects into living symbols that can help us live. For what she carried, the bit of bread and her broken comb, and why she carried them, speaks to the wisdom of love itself and makes us ask, what small thing do we each carry that we can give to others more in need than we? And what constant gesture do we carry by which we can affirm our person. To carry these questions alone is life-sustaining. I think that's so powerful that each one of us carries something, maybe some part of our personality or some experience from our lives, some wisdom that we've gained over the years that helps us have something to give other people. And each of us needs every day to affirm the people that we are, that we have something to give, because we do. And it's a false humility that says, I don't have anything to give. Uh, it's actually a denial of a part of our humanity. Because every single person that we relate to adds to our lives and we add to other people's lives. If we're aware of that and celebrate that, not offering unasked for advice, not thinking of ourselves as some great treasure trove of wisdom, but just being available to share who we are when that's appropriate with people because we know that we have something to share because we are beloved children of God. That's our true self. So that's our thought for the day.